Alright, this video tutorial is going to cover the installation procedure for the sensor part of the Precision Soil Sensor System. At this point you should have already finished installation of the receiver as covered by the receiver installation video tutorial. After installing the receiver you should see two dashes displaying on the LCD. This means you're ready to move on to installing the sensor. Start by locating the battery hatch on the bottom of the sensor. You want to remove each of these four screws to install the batteries. Once you've removed the battery hatch, install three AA batteries. And then reinstall the battery hatch by screwing in those four screws again. Once you've finished screwing in the battery hatch, you flip over the sensor and should notice that a green LED is illuminated. At this point, the receiver should display the signal strength coming from the sensor on a scale from 0 to 10. So right now I've got 10.0 out of 10 possible points displaying. This means we're ready to go and install the sensor in our yard. To install the sensor, simply press it down into the ground. You can use your foot if you need to, but you want to make sure that it's flush with the surface of the ground. When installing the sensor it's important to keep your eye on the LED on top of the sensor. This will be a green color when you're well within the radio range. It'll be a yellow color if you're nearing the edge of the range and it'll be blinking red if you're out of the range at which point you would need to relocate the sensor closer to the receiver. Now that we've installed the sensor in our yard to initiate the calibration process of the sensor press the bypass button once and you should see the letters CA start to display on the LCD. This will last 24 hours before it starts its normal operation after completing the calibration procedure. This concludes the sensor installation video tutorial.